they're actually adorable and I wasn't expecting to see so many babies with their mothers as well. <gasps> I think it might be the cutest thing I've ever seen. Welcome back to our channel guys. Today we will be ticking off one of our biggest Japanese bucket list destinations, the Jiko Kodani Snow Monkeys. If you've seen pictures or videos of red faced monkeys covered in snow and relaxing in a hot spa, then the chances are it's from this location we will be visiting today. In our last video, we shared our top things to see and do in Tokyo and have since taken the train to the Nagano prefecture where we will be exploring all there is to see and do in the snowy Alps of Japan. This is amazing. Whilst you can visit Jiko Kodani throughout the year, you can only visit the snow monkeys during the winter months, where they can be found soaking hours on end in the hot spas. So in this video, we cover when to visit, how to get to this place, how long to spend there, and just everything you need to know in general about these famous Japanese snow monkeys. This has officially become my favorite part of Japan ever. It's snowing. It's snowing. We're prepared, we're wrapped up warm like a big marshmallow today. <laughs> right, first stop, coffee. So we are ready to commence our day now that we have purchased our caffeine. We were gonna cheap out and go to 7-Eleven, but we spotted a coffee shop yesterday, Forrick Coffee. If you're in Nagano, check it out, it's good coffee. We're starting our 15 minute walk down to Nagano Station, where we then have to try and figure out where we stand for the bus, which is the express bus, all the way to the Snow Monkey forest. So we've made it to Nagano station. Now there's two ways you can get to the Snow Monkey Park. Option one is you grab a bus. Now there is an express bus that leaves from the east side entrance from bus stop number 23 or you can grab a train from Nagano station to Yamanka station but then you have to grab a local bus from Yamanka station to the park which takes another 10 minutes and then it's a 40 minute walk from the entrance of the park to the actual onsen of where the monkeys bathe themselves. We're going for the express bus. Now the reason why we're doing that is because we looked at the timings last night and it worked out that the express bus would be the least hassle and hopefully stress free. Now you're probably asking, where do you buy tickets? Well, we've got you covered. Head down the escalator beside Nagano Station and follow signs for the Nagano Dentetsu line. Take a left at the bottom and then walk down the tunnel where you will find a booth on the right hand side. We bought the two day pass. It covers a one time entry into the Snow Monkey Park with unlimited use of the express bus or express train across a two day period. So for instance, you could grab the express bus there and then on the way back, grab the express train where you have the option to hop off and visit some beautiful stops along the way. Buying the two day pass actually saves you about 400 yen per person versus paying for transport separately and then entry into the park once you get there. It's up to you, but we found these were more beneficial. So now we're walking through Nagano Station to try and find the east exit where we believe platform number 23 is so we can catch the express bus to the Snow Monkey Park. As you can see guys, there is already a long queue for the first express bus to the Snow Monkey Forest. Okay, we've just been informed by someone on the platform, an inspector perhaps, that we actually have to go to platform 24 because we have the monkey pass. We have the shiny new silver bus and all the peasants have the old looking bus. <laughs> So after approximately an hour, we have made it to the Snow Monkey Park. Our warmers are being prepared because it is currently zero degrees outside. We are essentially just following the rest of the crowd up what appears to be a mountainside. I think this is the way. They've got a, an animated cartoon of the snow monkey's red face. Brilliant. We've got 1.8 kilometers before we get to the monkey park. Cool, it is icy. Oh, wow. And I am wearing the wrong shoes. Ends of cafe, all right. See you on the way down. At least there is somewhat of a trail in the sense of paved steps. But as I said before, it is icy, so tread carefully. If you can start smelling the sulfur, you know you're close because it starts to smell like rotten eggs. Here we are, Snow Monkey Park. And for those of you that want to know how much it costs to get in, it's 800 yen for an adult 
400 for a child, and if you're a group, it becomes less. Or covered if you bought the snowman for cups. We're on the last leg now, Bob. Oh, my legs just don't want to go anymore. <laughs> We've literally averaged about 10,000 steps per oh, day, or more. More, more than that. We've made it. And do not fly drones in this area. Take photographs underwater or use the six to take photos. Let's go in. Hey, guys, to mouse. Alex, he's cleaning her like I clean you in the morning. As we've highlighted before, we got the very first express bus to the Snow Monkey Park, and it's already pretty busy near the onsen where the snow monkeys are. We'll try and get as close as possible. Do you want to go up top or down below? Um, down below. Yeah? We'll go below first. Come on then. Wow. <laughs> officially become my favourite part of Japan ever. Danny, also known as Snow Monkey Park, 1000% lived up to the hype. I thought horse riding in the snow was my favourite thing. <laughs> I think the Snow Monkey Park might have just picked it, or certainly on par. That was such an amazing experience. I think my face has frozen <laughs> with a smile <laughs> on it. I have my hand. Because that experience was uh, pretty spectacular. Ooh. As we said at the start of this vlog, that was high on our bucket list. <laughs> like before even coming to Japan, you see these snow monkeys <laughs> on like National Geographic, David Attenborough, Planet Earth. <laughs> they were the most zen monkeys I've ever seen in my life. My hands are actually frozen from Ooh. taking so many photos, so many videos. Our camera roll is now just oh, monkeys. zen monkeys. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I say this a lot, but you have to come here. The fact that it's so close to Tokyo, really, if you just grab the bullet train and then it's like an hour from Nagano Station, make the time to come here because it was worth every single cent, every single penny, and every single yen. So guys, if you enjoyed this video as much as we did, please hit that like button. And if you enjoyed the Zen Monkeys, also hit the like button. And if you want to stay tuned and see more of Japan, then don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you on the next video.